I love how Knuckles is such a pain to beat, and yet when you play as him, he sucks. You should be quiet during the cutscenes, you filthy Frank. I should be audible during the cutscenes. <laughs> Oh my god, Amy, no! Be quiet. Yes. Hello everybody, welcome to Let's Play Freedom Planet with my idiot friend. Meow. <laughs> oh, this is gonna be fun. Okay, so we're gonna be doing adventure mode because that's how playthroughs work with this game, even though I'd rather not. <laughs> Anywho, so uh, we have to shut up again, sadly. You won't be able to hear my beautiful voice because we have a cutscene coming up. Yay! Ladies and gentlemen, this is how the world ends. <laughs> A giant meteor crashed! Then they try to troll. Obama took over the universe. <laughs> Why three days later, though? Out of all the numbers... And time periods. And paradoxes. Stop. Starts up this. I don't even know what to call this. This trash. And I'm gonna be playing as Lilac. So this is Dragon uh -oh, Battle. <laughs> so right off the bat, you can tell that this is one of the best characters in the game, which is why I chose her, obviously. And I failed that. Um, but okay. So each character has their own variety of moves. But since you'll only be seeing why, like I'm only going to, I'm only going to explain. I'm only going. I'm only going to explain why, like because everybody else is useless in this game. So, Lilac, when running on the ground and you press down an X, she can do this move called the Cyclone, which is very useful during combat. You can also do it in the air by pressing, well, the jump key twice. 
You can also do an uppercut and a down kick by pressing either up or down and the attack button. Lilac has a special move, being that she's a dragon, given the name Lilac the Dragon, called the Dragon Boost. Dragon, 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 dragon. Um, so, basically what this move does is, you can use it to boost in any direction. It gives you an amazing sense of speed, but you can also use it to get to certain places that you went before. And you can also use it to get certain achievements, like that one right there. If you skip that door using a Dragon Boost, then you get an achievement for that. Um, Ladies and gentlemen, this is Sonic Generation Studio. Alright. Basically. He sums it up perfectly. Um, and that's pretty much all you need to know. She can also do a stand jump kick and, no. um, but that's, you know, you just jump and press the attack button and you can also do a hair whip on the ground by pressing the attack button while standing still or running. That's pretty much all you need to know. Also, this down kick is really useful for getting speed when going downhill, so keep that in mind if you ever do decide to get this game, which I recommend you do, because this game is actually really good. So the first stage, Dragon Valley, has each stage has this really cool transition. Like this one has a really cool transition. You beat the mini boss, and then boom, you're in a forest type area, which I think is pretty cool. It's a really nice level transition. Um, notice that I'm using a lot of these tricks to cut off other tricks. Uh, for speedrunners, um. If you haven't seen like most speedruns of this game, they use they use these type of tricks often to cut off like different momentum to try to do like different things. And so if you want to be a speedrunner at this game, then that's really important to know. I sort of speedrun this game as you can kind of tell, but not really because I'm not all that good at it. I'm good at the game, just not good at speedrunning it. Like, I will rarely die until, like, the later stages, which is a given, right? I doubt anybody really dies at the beginning. Oh, wow, okay. I messed up the speedrunning trick of, of the century. No one's gonna love me. <laughs> but, by the way, when you do that down cyclone on the ground... When you jump, it's almost as if you did a, a regular cyclone in the air, because it gives you a lot of height, and sometimes it's best to do that to get more height, like here. That's what I was trying to do. And that is a really cool speedrunning trick that I was trying to pull out the first time. Uh, I just wanted to show that off. I'll be showing off kind of quite a few, and also you saw I was running on a sloped hill. Um, yeah, the physics in this game are kind of wonky as in whenever there's a curved slope and sometimes not even just a curved slope sometimes you can just pass right under objects and it'll take you above and it's like really weird uh you'll see more of it later on throughout this playthrough because it's kind of hard to not run across it in this game this video is brought to you in part by cool rock no Cool Rom, is, be cool. cool Rom is dead, and finally the idiot code commentator speaks. Are you guys excited? No? Hey! I wouldn't be either. I'm barely gonna be talking throughout this whole playthrough. Enjoy. No, you're gonna speak because I'm gonna force him. I'm a terrible person, ladies and gentlemen. I force people to speak. You're lucky because we have to shut up anyway because it's cutscene. How many chasers are left? Tell me. You didn't say please. <laughs> Don't play games with me, Duckling. Tell me. Fine, be that way. Where's that plastic snake out? I guess we'll have to do this the hard way. The hard way? Hmm. Gross. What is this hideous creature? Stay back! <coughs> oh no! The duck man comes with me! I'm not gonna let you eat him! What? What the? <laughs> Too 
too easy. Whoa, that was a close one. Thank you, Miss, um... Uh, Lilac. Miss Lilac. Are you okay? I saw a huge explosion back there. You've been following me this whole time, haven't you? Duh. I take it you know this guy. Girl. <laughs> Ouch. This girl. <laughs> She's like my tail. Always right behind me. Carol the Wildcat, at your service. And this is Lilac. Well, I'm Tork. I'm a shell duck. Shell duck? It's more of a nickname. I'm not exactly from around here. So what are you doing out here? The skies haven't been safe for days. Someone is about to steal the Kingdom Stone, and I have to stop them. The Kingdom Stone? That's impossible. Yeah, only I could steal it. You wish. Well, it's already happening. Marisawa is sending troops in disguise to the ancient temple. I have to warn them. Carol and I are pretty fast. We could run over there for you. Seriously? Yup, I've got a motorcycle and she's a rocket. They're like super fast. Turn straight. It's worth a shot. Hurry over there before it's too late. What about you? I'll catch up with you as soon as I find all my stuff. Right. Come on, Carol. Is that Vector the Duck? Vector the Duck? General Gaunt! You two again? It's nice to see you too. We have to talk to you. The Kingdom Stone is in danger! Don't be ridiculous. Nothing gets past my nose. Will you just listen for a minute? What is the meaning of this? That is my favorite line. We mean no disrespect. We're just you trying heard to. What the general said? There's nothing to worry about. But don't make me repeat myself. So much emphasis on every word. Well, they sound like they know what they're doing. Why don't we just charge up and go home, huh? What do you say? Mm, I don't know. I feel like they're hiding something from us. Oh. And that be all, folks, for this ep for this episode of Freedom Planet. This was a somewhat start. To this terrible episode. Um, be sure to dislike. Um, <laughs> Leave a hate comment and... Leave a hate comment, rated 0 0.5, and, uh, on Scrub Screen. Yeah, um, I'm gonna be playing Sonic Advance 3. I will see you guys, probably not, um, Sonic. If he isn't there, I'll probably have another guest, or I'll probably do some like, cause he's yeah, just probably. here for this one, cause we'll we'll have a channel eventually with our like our own channel, like a group channel, but not right now, because he's too much of a casual. Plus, I'm uploading I, I, this to I my account. Um, brain sketch, comms. They're just better at this. Anywho, um, all of you have a wonderful day and um. Go on, go prom. Wait. What? <laughs> Disregard what we said earlier and like, comment, subscribe, and rate if you can even do that on YouTube still. Um, and everybody have a wonderful day, and I'd also like it if you supported this game and bought it on Steam, because it is really awesome, and I think everybody should give this game a shot. You <laughs> know, even though the voice acting is terrible, just play classic mode, it, you, you'll love your life. <clears throat> Toodle! I hate this guy. <laughs>